Hello everyone and welcome back. Last time we met Annabelle the Anteater who just moved in with us and other than that there wasn't anything else much to do really except speak to Paolo who's the elephant, the pink elephant, and you know just enjoying life on the island. Uh, I did play some off time and we did collect some fish. We collected the tuna and also, for some reason, we collected the Ranchu goldfish. I caught two twice in a row, back to back. And that the same thing happened with the sturgeon. I caught two in a row, back to back. It took forever spawning the first one, but after we got the first one, perceived, for some reason, getting the second one was extremely easy because it will be the next fish. So I don't know how the mechanic works. I don't know if that's just my luck or anything. But yeah, let me just go into my house. And there's the ranchu goldfish and the sturgeon. I just have to get my bait. Also got some new furniture. Um, like the facts, I believe, was off camera and other things as well. And this pool. So what I'm going to do today is actually uh, knock down some trees. Not knock down, um, just get some wood from the trees, the pine trees up on the cliffs because I need to have the chance to get a spider. Which apparently only occurs on the pine trees on these cliffs. And hopefully we find a wasp. I don't know, we haven't been finding wasps. And more importantly, hopefully we get some of those super rare fish. Oh, hi, Paolo. I'll speak to you first. Oh yeah, and I also collected a lot of money. Oh wait. Oh, kind of weird how they keep bumping into each other today. You've got a ladder. I love ladders. Ladders make you taller than you are without needing to find new legs. So anyways. Hopefully we find... A spider. We'll keep the net on with us, just in case. No! Oh my gosh! My character... I had the net ready. But my character decided to shake the tree instead. Oh, so I see a present. Oh, thank goodness. Five thousand bells. Oh yeah, that reminds me. I got a lot of money. I can actually pay Tom Nook my rent. Or debt, I mean. So we're going to do that tonight. And then hopefully if we have time, I'll also get, or at least attempt to get the fish. Okay, the butterfly's right there. This is a very valuable butterfly. Oh, 
Oh yeah, and hopefully we can get a centipede. Centipede, but we did get money. Always good to have extra material just in case you have to build something. So tomorrow we should get not only our octopus friend, but also I'm pretty sure it's Biff's birthday tomorrow. I wonder what we're going to be doing. Ooh, some furniture. Intercom monitor. Interesting. So where's the spider? Finally! Oh my gosh. Finally.
No! Oh my gosh. I'm dead. Sigh. I tried to get the wasp, but I shake the tree instead. I don't know why. I wish the mechanic was a bit smarter about that. Like, obviously there's a wasp, so my character should swing the net. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to get some medicine before the store closes. Oh, they closed. 15 minutes ago. Actually, now that I think about it, I should be able to craft my own medicine. Oh, I'm so glad that happened. Oops. I'm healed. Okay, what does the stone axe require? I'm pretty sure it's stone and something else. Yeah, just stone.
Okay. I want this butterfly. Come here. You're worth a lot. I know I'm not talking very much right now, but just know I'm having a lot of fun, even if it's just collecting just general materials. I think everyone should get this game, honestly. It's so good. Because sometimes you just need a retreat from life. game to do it. You know what, I'm going to start collecting honeycombs. For the purpose of making medicine myself. Without having to purchase. I'm already out of pocket space. There we go. Yeah, swap it. You're pretty valuable. Okay, I'll temporarily get rid of you. What? That sucks. That so sucks. I couldn't put anything down because there's not enough space down here. That's so stupid. That is just absolutely stupid. Oh, I hate that. I was robbed, honestly. Okay. Time to organize my stuff.
Oh yeah, you're not open. Okay, you... 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 I had to put some stuff in my room. I hear a present. There it is. And what is it? A beach chair. There. Right in front of the snooker. on the wall the intercom monitor oh it's a monitor why was I thinking a computer well technically it is a computer but Okay, I don't like this placement. I want to buy this house. And I'll put it... Oh, where did it go? Must be in the storage. It's right here. Perfect. I really hope. What? My storage is full. How can my storage be full? What? Let's move you in my pockets and see if you're able to move any place. No. You have to be placed in storage. Oh wow, I didn't expect that. I thought my storage would have been unlimited, like it should be, but interesting. Yeah, my house is fine, but... I think I want to upgrade it. Yeah, what's my money tree gonna grow? So what am I going to do? What am I going to do 
with this storage conundrum. No, see, that happens all the time, like literally all the time. Oh my gosh. That's so annoying, honestly. Not really so see what you are. I don't think you're like the giant, giant fish, but. Cherry salmon. And I still haven't seen a single spider. Well, at least we found some furniture. But really, I don't know why storage couldn't be unlimited. Oh. Have to get another axe. Paula has to go all the way around the island just to meet it, me. What's this one? Iron nuggets. You can always use that. An amp. Thank you. 
Alrighty, hopefully we can finish our chores now. Seriously, there was no spider. Where was it? Maybe I used up all my luck getting the Ranchu Goldfish and the Sturgeon. Two of them in a row. And I don't mean Ponchu, a s Goldfish, then a Sturgeon. I meant two Ponchu Goldfish. And also two sturgeon. Both catches back to back. And I'm like, my gosh. It makes me think if the luck is based on time instead of like RNG every single event, maybe it's based on time? I don't know. I'm probably just hypothesizing, but who knows? Well, the game developers know, but they're not telling me, so, oh well. Phew! Okay. Since we're up here... Let's just use this bait. Nope, you are the tiny fish. You're probably a waste of time, but you know what? You can at least give me some money. You are even tinier. Okay, now you are a big one. Nope, just a dace. And again, I know there's a silent pause, but... Whenever there's something giant that I suspect is rare, I have to mute my microphone and turn on the TV speakers just so there's no delay in my sound reflexes. Because there is a bit of lag between the game and what my um, computer records. And since my headphones are connected to the computer, I just have to deal with it. Okay, so we did finish all the chores. I might just do the fish off screen. Even though they are rare and it will be nice to see on screen. I think I'll leave that magic um, up to you guys. So you can all experience it on your own. Okay, I hear a balloon. Now where is it? Nope.
Oh my gosh. What? Why did I delay my net? Why was my net delayed? That did not make sense. That was rigged. That was rigged, I say. This seems excessive, but okay. I'll just have the loudest house in the neighborhood. Is there anything in storage that I can just sell? Uh, you know what? No, I'll just keep everything like that then. Yeah, then I don't just have to not do chores because I already collected the max I can find. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it like that. Oh, I see another tarantula. Nope, that's not a tarantula. I was scared for a moment. But we do have the wasp, so let's give it two bladders. Who I think is up right now because it's night time. Yes, make a donation. I would like to donate this wasp. That keeps killing me. Yes, please. Wasps are sometimes called meat bees because they eat meat. Meat of almost any sort. Surely you've been or surely you've seen what a menace they make of themselves at picnics. Tis hardly the worst of it. Woot woot. Aggressive predators with venomous stingers, wasps not only hunt and eat each other insects, they paralyze their prey, then drag their victims home alive, leaving them for their larvae to feed upon. Suddenly, a simple sting seems quite tolerable. So we are making really good progress. Yes. And so, all these things I just have an access of. And you know what, Tom Nook? You know what? Guess what? Yes, I have one bell left. Aha! Tom Nook clapping his chest. Now what do you have to say, Tom Nook? I 
I can't imagine the feeling of satisfaction you must have. Truly, what could be better, hmm? Well, I suppose you could have another room. That might technically be considered better. Oh, don't mind me, I simply can't help myself. But do come see me if I piqued your interest. Yes, please. I need another room, I have so many things. Well, for your home, I think adding a new room would be nice. If we add it on the back, it won't change the look of the home. But you'll get so much more space. It'll also keep the construction costs down, relatively speaking. This will require taking out a loan for 348,000 bells. Yeah, okay. Excellent, I'll get the construction right away. Everything should be ready for you by tomorrow morning. So exciting, exciting indeed. Oh wow, that's fast. I'll get a new room overnight. Okay, let me just double check. I know I did all my shopping, but just wanting to double check that I have everything I want. You know what? I'll buy a ticket. No. Oh, you dumb wasp. Rancho Goldfish. Oh, it tells me if I donated something with that owl icon. Oh my gosh, that is so useful, actually. By their name, there's an owl icon, which I'm guessing means I've donated it. Oh, that's so great. I like that. I got Nook Miles for spending miles. Why is there smoke in my house? I don't have an oven. Alrighty guys, that's going to be it for today. Um, I'm going to see what island I'll get. And if I get a good island, I'll also record another episode tonight. But if it's not a good island, then I'll just not record. And if I do get a good island, if I have time, then I'll record trying to get some fish. But if I don't have a good island, then I'm not going to record that either. But anyways... I'm so excited for tomorrow. We're going to get a bigger house. We're going to have more room to put furniture. And also, we're going to have a new neighbor, the octopus. And it's going to be Biff's birthday. So excited. Can't wait. And I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.